Now, the return of rain means renewed concerns about landslides. We have seen them across the area in the recent weeks, including Kilbuck Township, where they have become far too common and where homeowners caught in their path face a harsh reality. Amy Wattis joins us now. Details. Amy. Rick, and every time it rains like it is now, residents here in Kilbuck Township are very concerned about landslides. In fact, one couple is actually suing the people their home. Kilbuck Township Manager Harry Dilmore says the township has had a dozen slides in the past eight years. The most famous is the Walmart slide that buried Route 65 several years ago. An upset homeowner took her concerns to township supervisors during their meeting last night. Two days after the couple closed on their house last March, the hillside crushed the back wall. They're suing the people that built their home in part for not knowing what they were building on. Township engineers are keeping an eye on the land. It continues to possibly move, uh, especially with all the rain that we've been getting. Uh, surveillance has to continue there. I think barricades and, and, and other safety um, uh, measures have been put in place. Now the red clay below that house, like below the Tamaros who live down the street on Old Camp Horn Road, acts like a slip and slide when it gets wet and everything on top of it succumbs to gravity. It took out the main portion of the Tamaros house earlier last month, this month rather. Now the township manager says there is not much they can do about these landslides because they are built on private property other than wait until they clean up the mud once it goes onto the township road. But the township manager says he will do all he can to help these people out. We're live in Kilbuck Township this morning. Amy Wattis, KDKA TV Morning News.